the 0-1 is swung on and ripped. There's a base hit in the right field. Wells fields it in right, scoring easily as Alvarez from third, rounding third, and coming home from second is Dylan Blue. And the Cougs are on top, 2-0 in the first inning. The choo-choo pitch, swung on and missed, strike three. Fastball comes low and in, a lot of movement on that pitch. And the 2-2 pitch is grounded through the hole and right, a seeing eye single. And the red light is put on for Sinatra. Ball bobbled in right, and now he comes home and doesn't even need to slide. Game is tied at four. And here's the 0-2 to Taylor. Swung on and chopped third base side, gloved by Matheny. Fair territory, throws across his body and gets him out at first on a 5-3 put out. Matheny, he was way into foul territory. A really long throw for Matheny. Big pitch here, the 2-2, swung on and turned down the line. That'll drop in, could be extra bases. Two runs score easily. Blake Clanton wheels around for a two RBI stand-up double. And the Cougs lead it 6-4 with two outs in the seventh. And there is strike three looking. A breaking ball comes inside. And Walker puts Ciancio down. He swings on the first pitch and hits it up into right field. Wynn may carry it. It is over the wall and it's gone. A solo shot the opposite way for Cal Waterman and gives the Cougs a 7-4 lead in the eighth. And the 1-1 is swung on and lined into right field. There's a base hit. Giving the green light to go around third is Hare. And Washington State leads it 8-4. An RBI single for James Rudkin. Lefty fires a chopper right up the middle. Could be a glove by Andre. Spins, throws to first, and maybe the best defensive play of the day. A 360 from Andres Alvarez to shut the game down. Washington State beats Seattle U 9 to 4.